What's going on YouTube? So, um, just realized that I'm supposed to be making a video about this and I'm halfway into it. So I'm going to turn the camera around. So this is what I'm doing. Uh, as you can see, all that is in orange there and I'm doing it to my center console. So what I've done is real simple. I've taken out, uh, the top piece which is right here, two seven meter, two seven millimeter screws. And then uh, I took out my console, which is right here. And all this was attached with another two seven millimeter screws. And I'm pulling it out now. So this I'm going to paint, this I'm going to paint, and then I'm gonna put it back in. So um, this part is super easy. It was, two uh seven millimeters on the top back here and then two seven millimeters right here and then just a prying tool to pop these out so that's where i am now uh and i'll see you when i start to paint all right so we are back in the paint lab and as you can see this is what i'm going to paint is this nice little lovely chrome piece no chrome belongs in my truck so we're going to take this off i'm going to go ahead and paint this uh in the paint lab and then what we're also going to do is we're going to take this piece off and we're going to paint this nice little ensemble here i'm going to paint that orange as well so i've done it before and um it comes out pretty good so uh i think i'm going to spare you uh the talk about the paint uh, i am a spray cut uh, a Wow. I am a spray paint. I, wow. I am a spray paint in a can person. Wow. And so, boom shakalaka. That's going to be my paint for the day. And uh, we're going to get into it. Real simple couple cloaks a little bit of clear all right guys sorry about that i was eating breakfast just some oatmeal but i wanted to show you um this is the inside of the vent um and it's very simple uh what you do is you remove this whole slide okay um you're gonna remove this whole slide and it looks similar to this what you do is all you're going to do is you're going to pop out both sides right here and right here with your hand. It's real smooth, real simple. Pop it out. Okay. And then you're going to bring it to this piece right here. Now, um, I should have showed you this while I was taking it apart, but this is what I'm going to paint. Okay. This goes on top of it like so and then this piece that I just dropped and go go gadget arm okay this piece is what controls um, whether where the slides to and the teeth right here control the back part there so let's see if I can do this okay let me do it with this one that makes more sense okay so as you can see this one is put together and see that little black tab back there that's that okay so as you move it to the left and to the right that controls the back portion of the vent and then this controls the front part of the vent okay so all i've done is i've taken this apart and i'm going to paint this part orange and then put it back together put the newly painted orange piece that was formerly chrome back on this and slide it back into beasting stay tuned okay as you can see ford cut some corners around there now technically I could spend hours trying to peel off this chrome, 
But, while Ford cut corners, and I couldn't notice it until I took it apart, guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to cut corners. Now, all I'm going to do, and because I'm not necessarily worried about that, because that little black tab goes over it, what I, what I am concerned about is the sides. So, that's what I'm going to do. Here we go. Okay, so uh, I have repainted that. It looks nice. I'm gonna put this back in here. And then, let's see, which side is that? We are going to put that on there. And then we're gonna put it back in the truck. So I'm gonna finish putting that one back together and then we'll see you on the outside. All right, so as you can see, they are completely functional again. Um, and they have been painted. So, unfortunately, this is a color of everything on the exterior, and it just doesn't match the knobs, but nonetheless. All right, uh, last and final piece is to put this back on and we will be done. So again, to put this back on, it's just clipping it uh, with the, oh, that's nice. These are orange on the inside. Isn't that nice? So anyway, got a brief plug. Um, the four connectors back in Stick these back into the appropriate place, pla places and then the seven millimeter screws and we're done. Easy peasy. This is the last and final piece. It goes back on like so with just connection tabs slapped in there. Two seven millimeter bolts. This guy goes back on to cover it. And we are done. And there you have it. That is a finished project. Now I am just waiting on my carbon fiber to cover that up. And we are done with the interior on this customized F-150 interior design. Like and subscribe to my channel. And if there's anything else that you all would like to see, give me a holler. Hey, infotainment.com. I am thinking about upgrading this, infotainment.com. I am also thinking about adding a rear view camera, infotainment.com, or anybody else that has the merchandise or products that is willing to uh, partner with me to do that, please let me know. Infotainment, you're my number one pick. Like and subscribe. I'm Stu. All this is Beastie. And um, look forward to seeing you on the next video. Awesome song. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Um, I have to apologize. I have not been staying diligent to my video making. Um, I was working, um, you know, 14 plus hours for a little while there. And, um, instead of, it was taking its toll. Uh, and of course, by I mean taking its toll, I was, um, obviously not making videos and my health was not doing too good as a result i believe that is how um i caught 19. Um, that being said i am alive and well so the youtube universe stand by i am alive and well uh so um one of my newest videos that I'm going to do is, I believe, 
I actually found some um, tail lights. So uh, I will probably uh, make a video sometime this week. Today is the second day of August. So hopefully sometime this week I will order them and they should be here by maybe Saturday. Um, stay tuned for that. Um, and um, more things to come, more things to come. So uh, please, again, don't lose hope in me. Please, you know anybody that is into um, just simple DIY, please share, uh, like, and subscribe, and uh, we'll keep the ball rolling. I appreciate you all, and uh, here's to a successful YouTube channel.